today, I've got something real special for you. We're gonna make my absolute favorite Franken rib. It's the best of both worlds. You got your short rib and your pork belly. You see, one night I had the ultimate dilemma. What was I gonna eat? I love short ribs, but I felt like pork belly. So I thought, what if we put the two together? So, what are you gonna need? Some beautiful short ribs. These are 100% kiwi, grass fed and finished. You're gonna need a pork belly. Meat glue, salt and pepper, butter. Real simple. So first of all, what you wanna do is uh, get your short rib. The bigger the better. Okay, so spread the meat glue on nice and even. It doesn't need much at all. Now you don't wanna breathe this shit in. All right, pork belly goes on top. You don't wanna be stretching it to the sides. So it needs to rest there nice and naturally. Now the next step for us is we chuck it in a vac bag and suckle the air out. At home, you can just chuck some baking paper over top of it and maybe a couple of weight to hold it down and put it in the fridge overnight. So get your barbecue up to temp, rain for about 275 Fahrenheit. Lube your meat and douse it in salt. All the hard work's done. Now it's time to chuck it in the barbie and have a few brews. So that's gone in at 275. And our total cook time will be about eight hours, as long as it normally takes you to cook your short ribs on your barbie. Uh, we're aiming for about three hours to wrap. We don't need heaps and heaps of smoke on this. And we'll chuck a little bit of baking paper on it and wrap it up real tight tin foil. Wait for the internal temperature to reach about 202, and she's gonna be curling. One and a half hour rest, get some crackle on, heat some butter sauce, beauty. 